Hey guys, we're back on Grandpa's farm here, and uh, I'm just bringing back the old uh, harvester here. And uh, yeah, I changed a couple things since the last time you uh, seen me on the farm here. And basically, what happened, which we need to harvest up, fill the canola. So that's one thing we're going to end up doing in this episode here. I'll just go ahead and get your lined up and everything. Let's see, I'm going to do it from this side so the path will be to the outside. Over. But I bought that cedar that I told you all I was going to buy. And I actually plowed a field. It was field 25 here. I don't know, guys. I'm Get this started here and then I'll show you. Uh, we're good to go. Uh, but yeah, field 25. As you can see, it was grass. And even though it still shows grass on the, uh, Map there, I completely made me a uh, field there so we can see it. So that's what we're gonna do after we get done harvesting. That'll probably be uh, episode eight. Can't believe I've already got eight episodes of the Let's Play Up. Um. But yeah, we need to go get to the uh, ducks. He thinks you're just sitting up here around the corner. Um. But one of the things I want to kind of talk about this episode is uh, if y'all haven't realized it or if it's a new TV show series to y'all, Astro Truckers just started their uh, 10th season. They did the premiere of it last night, actually. And for a premiere, it was a pretty damn good episode episode I think. Um let's see you start it with let's talk about the uh, drivers. So it's basically the same as last season. It's um Daryl Daryl and Lisa teamed up and then Polar has got Arch, Alex and Todd as their drivers. Okay? So, one of the difficulties of this season is they have to contend with El Nino. And El Nino is a weather front that um, changes the typical weather patterns of any given system. So basically what is going on with them is they're having unusually warm temperatures. I'm just, yeah, that's what I thought. I was not stuck, okay. I thought it was. But they're having unusually warm temperatures. They said, uh, Yesterday felt like it was spring to them and that they should be ending the season. So, yeah. Um, it was a pretty good <clears throat> episode, I thought, overall. And, guys. If you're into this kind of thing and you want to kind of support me more and 
you see this video and you're like, I want to learn more about Astro Truck and I want to see what this guy knows about Astro Truck, okay? Well, I'm planning on doing a podcast style episode for anybody that's interested. And I've already got the first one up on the channel. And if you guys are interested in it, and if you want to go check it out, maybe leave a like on the video if you like it. Or if you're brand new to the channel and you want to go ahead and subscribe, go ahead and subscribe. So, yeah. Um, so, a little bit of an update on Grandpa. He's doing okay. The doctor said that he can't come back to the farm though for about another six weeks. So we'll be at this for at least six more weeks, maybe even longer. Um, so what I've done is um, Bob actually had some more fields that he wanted me to uh Harvest. Well, that's actually our field, but we'll just say Bob owns them. So I took the harvester down there and I harvested those fields. And uh, he is going to give us a Massey Ferguson. An old style Massey Ferguson. So uh, when he gets that ready, I'm going to hook that up on the cultivator and let that thing be pulled by that Matthew Ferguson. Um, guys, I do know that there is a map update thanks to uh, the guy there, I lost his name again. Hang on. Mr. Uh, Species 7. I'm sorry. I couldn't, think of, I couldn't think of your name, but species. But um, basically, uh, what's going on with him is I asked him, because he's got a small channel. Uh, it's bigger than mine, but still count as a small channel. And I'm like, Dave, what kind of tags do you use in your videos? Because, you, you know, I kind of like to get my videos out there for more people to see. He's like, I do not go over 30 tags on my videos. And he gave me this uh, thing to check out that was supposed to, you are supposed to be able to view the uh, tags of the videos using this program called YouTube Buddy. Um, so I checked that out, and apparently, uh, species, I'm not sure if you realize this, but apparently you've got to sign up for the, uh, website, and you need to pay at least $9 a month before they release everything to you. Um, so I'm still kind of up in the air, so species, if you watch this, uh, what do I do now, brother? Um, but yeah, thanks for all the help there. Thanks for actually subscribing to the channel and actually showing me that you are actually wanting to watch my content. Um, so yeah, if any of y'all have an uh, idea about that, just let me know. We're going to let this combine finish filming up here and then we'll go off of it. Uh, that's a smaller field than what I was thinking it was, uh, so yeah. So I'm trying to think if there's anything new going on. Uh, oh yeah guys, if you go to the channel and you look at the subscriber box, or if you just look down at my subscription box as you're watching this video, we jumped two subscribers for like five days. Um, now I know 
species is one of them. And I know the other guy. But technically we jumped like three subscribers because there's one that hasn't showed up in my subscription box um, for me to see yet. But basically what's going on with that, which I'll get into that a little bit later, is that well, I'll go ahead and get into it now. We'll wait for the hours here because it looks like it's taking a while. Um, I use Google. I use Internet Explorer on my Windows 10. And people's like, well, that's okay. I use Google. I use uh, Internet Explorer on mine too. Um, well, see, the fact of the matter is. I got mine for actually Windows 7. So mine's a Windows 7 plugin. And apparently mine takes a little bit longer than everybody else to upload. No, not, not to upload, but to update. Um, so that I'm still trying to get that figured out. But yeah. We're up to 18 subscribers, I guess. Um, so, yeah, let's look and see how many acres the harvester has uh, done. Now, guys, I know that counter right there is actually a hectare counter but I'm from the US and we get measured in acres so basically I'm just going to go ahead and call that an acreage counter and give it over with because that's basically what it is to me species can tell you So we'll go ahead and let that finish emptying out, and then we'll move the truck. Which, if you guys haven't gone check out Species, uh, just tap in Mr. Species 7 on the YouTube there and it should pull up his YouTube channel and species if you wouldn't mind giving me a shout out on uh, one of your videos coming up I would not mind one bit I actually kind of want you to yeah I've been pondering about what we're going to do with this over tractor now if you're like me I like the over tractor. And I don't know what we're going to do with it. Because basically it's only got 30 horsepower. And, um,. So I don't know what it's good for because a plow, it can do that, but it can only use that little big green plow that comes in the classic farming pack. So I wanted to use it to pull a seed trailer with, but pulling that green trailer that I got hooked up to the uh, duds here is 11,000. Um, I'm sorry, 11 ton. Um, and the seed trailer holds 15 ton of seed, so or 15 liters or whatever you want to call it. Um, so what do you think, guys? Should we sell the old uh, red tractor or keep the old red tractor? Let me know in the comments below.
I just don't know what it would be good for. Um, I have seen him, when I mean him, I mean Species 7. Uh, use it to pull a field trailer. And that may be what we use it for. But I don't think there's a field trailer on this map, Species. If you know, uh, let me know because you've been playing this map longer than I have. Um, matter of fact, he's actually the one that I've seen playing this map. But, well, I can do a uh, old school uh, play through on that map, so right here we are. So if you know if there's a field trip on this map, species, let me know. And that harvester's a little bit too loud, I guess I'm gonna turn them down here. I don't want to turn it on very much more, so I think we'll just look like he is. Pop out. Well, they the tractor, I mean the harvester running, go get the ducks. And, uh, we'll go get her off of it, and then we'll probably take it and sell it, and then that'll be episode. And then I'll get the, uh, Oh, Bill, oh, Bob there, and, uh, I'll get, I'll get them there, and, uh, see if, oh, good God, you're a curse or not, but, um, I'll get up with him and see what we're going to do about the Massey Ferguson for maybe next episode, but, um, with all the fields that I got open, I think it'll be a while before we, uh, Actually, need that cultivator again, cause basically I've cut, I've harvested every field that I could, and then I went ahead and cut right back over the ones that I wanted to use. So yeah, which there was only like two fields maybe that I um. Didn't feel like using the harvester. Um, so yeah. So let me hop back over into the harvester here and get it cut off. Fold it up. I'll take it down, stick it in the building. So yeah, uh, I just want to thank you guys again for supporting uh, me and this channel because if y'all don't know it, this channel got started on a bet between me and a couple of my buddies that they said people would watch me and my foolish self do videos. They're like, man, nobody's gonna watch me play video games and all that. And they're like, yeah, man, they will. So, um, came home that night and actually made out the YouTube channel. And, like, the first week we got, like, um, nine subscribers. So I just want to thank you all again for supporting me. And uh, let me bring the content that I do bring to you all. Uh, to you. And uh, you all really make me want to get up in the morning and record a video for you all. But. There's a but. There's always a but. 
I'll be starting college here soon. So, um, I'll have to go to class, yada, yada, yada. We all hate college, don't we? So, uh, I'm not sure when there's going to be a video or if there's going to be a set schedule for the videos. The videos are still going to happen, I'm just not sure when. So, uh, just, you know, just view every video I put up. Uh, if you don't like the video, just click on it and watch it for a few seconds. Figure out what's going on and leave. But if you don't like what you see, just like, and share, and comment, and show your friends and subscribe. Because you, you all are really what makes me uh, want to get up and do this every day with people that want to stick by me and stuff and actually subscribe to the channel and so I just want to take a minute there and uh, thank you all for the people that have subscribed and for the future subscribers. a little bit of frame rate dropper but not too bad so yeah I think when I get this load empty and we see how much money I get I'll end the episode here I mean there because uh, it's getting late at night guys and I've been up since 6.30 so I'm kind of getting tired We uh, gotta get a uh, corn head on the harvester here pretty soon and uh, harvest some corn. Phil 20 has some on it. I've noticed a couple of the fields that's got some on it. So, um, yeah, uh, we'll get that crack in here too. So did you see how the get dudes there climb that hill? Um, basically, if I hooked a red tractor up to try to climb that hill, it bogged down to like three or four mile there. That's basically why I kind of retired that red tractor, like I did. Let's see here. Here's the entrance. So we only got 21% of Canova in the trailer, which I don't think will bring that much, but Candela has always been a lower year, but a higher price when you go to sell it. So we'll see. Uh, how much did we get there? Thirteen forty. It ain't too bad. But anyways, guys, I think I'll end this episode here. So as always. 
We'll catch you in the next one. And hopefully y'all like what you've seen today. And you will subscribe. We'll catch you later. I'm out.